retain gain what's popping man so sometimes being alone can give you the answers that you seek it can be the key to finding your happiness and your success you feel me make sure you guys smash that like button for me also make sure you subscribe to the channel that way you don't miss none of this fire you feel me also before we start man you guys go ahead and join the retain gang community if you're interested and you want to be a part of a community that's going to listen to you that you can vibe with and that can understand you all right we do weekly live calls and discussions with some high vibrational conversations all right so i'll leave a link in my description and in my pinned comments invest in yourself man right self-work is the best work confirmation so i realized throughout my life that anytime i spend time alone with myself this is when i come up the most this is when i become powerful spiritually mentally and physically all right let me know in the comments section do you feel more powerful when you spend time alone when you out the way right now i'm talking about taking three to six months to just grind stack your bread up right gain some knowledge read some books hit the gym change your habits clean your diet up stay focused no distractions how does that make you feel right and you got to ask yourself why do i feel this way anytime i take time to myself why does it always make me come up and make me powerful my theory is you stop giving your energy away so freely see when you out in public when you're around a lot of people they are taking your energy your energy is being stolen you're giving your energy away you're leaving your energy at all these places in these buildings that you're walking into it's taking your energy and this is why you feel so drained this is why you don't have enough for yourself anytime i'm out too much i'm outside too much i'm giving my attention to people too much even in relationships whenever i'm in this mode i start losing start losing my finances start losing my mind i start to lose my way my direction i get bumped off my path a little bit right now i'm not saying you can't be around people sometimes you might want to hang out and mingle that's cool but if you feel like you got to be around people all the time you need that validation you, you need that instant gratification you're afraid to be alone by yourself you might need to do some deep soul searching because that that's something that's deep within that you gotta straighten out you gotta correct that see when you become enlightened you start to be to yourself more because your energy is so powerful man and you agitate people when you get around them you absorb a lot of energy that's not yours so you got to protect yourself more you know this happened to me especially when i started doing semen retention my nervous system was powered up so i started to feel more energy in my surroundings right and it would make me anxious you guys let me know did you get anxious when you first started doing semen retention yeah man i used to get anxious because people's energy used to it used to disturb me and i didn't know how to protect myself yet I found myself being alone a lot of times or going out to nature like I am now. Being out here by myself, man, under this nice tree, this helps ground me. It helps me to be creative and to think. It helps me to figure out the next move in my life and make the right decisions. I try to come out here every single day, you know, especially now where it's still warm outside. We still got the trees and the leaves, you know, I try to get out here every single day for at least a couple of hours, man. This is taking care of yourself. That way, if I do want to be around some people, nature charged me up. You know, it filled my battery up. So now I got the energy to be around people and to give to others. But you got to make sure that you're doing something to charge yourself up. Because if you're like me, I'm an empath. I'm a water sign. And I tend to give more than what I have. I tend to empty my cup for others and then I don't have enough for myself. And this is something you might face if you're a giver, if you're someone who has 
a lot of love. You move with unconditional love. You're gonna find yourself giving to people a lot and not having nothing for yourself. And you'll start to realize the more you start being around people, the more you realize people don't care about you, right? They don't care that your cup is, is empty. As long as they got what they needed, they're gonna move on with their life. They only gonna come around you when they need something, when they're thirsty. They need a refill. Don't be a battery in anybody's life, okay? You give what you can, you give what you want. Don't let no one take your energy from you. A lot of you watching this video, you're very powerful. You have a big heart and you love to give. And there's people out here that's narcs, okay? You got sociopaths, people out here who they don't care about you, they wanna take advantage of you. They wanna take advantage of your good heart, your light. Okay? Don't let that happen to you. Protect yourself out here. If you got to, kick it with yourself. I promise you, when you learn how to kick it with yourself, man, you're gonna have so much fun. When I used to go out, I used to go out by myself. I used to go out to the bars by myself, you know, and just have my little drink and just be chilling in my own vibe. And I realized people always come around me and wanna start conversation. And I would have a good time. I didn't have to be with no friends. I didn't have to come in with a group of people. Sometimes when you're with a group of people, you can't do what you wanna do. You gotta move as a unit. And you might not be ready to leave yet, or you might be ready to leave and they're not. So learn how to treat yourself. Sometimes you might wanna go out, go out to eat. You ain't gotta be with a date or with someone. Go treat yourself. Go have you a nice little dinner. Trust me, it's gonna be cheaper, right? You can get what you want because you ain't gotta worry about paying for nobody else. You can just focus on you. And I promise you, when you learn how to be by yourself, man, you're gonna realize that you don't need anybody or anything but you. Because everything that you experience in life is a reflection of you. Your friends are a reflection of you, right? We all have a soul tribe. Your soul tribe is the people that you resonate with on a spiritual level. You can almost call them your soulmates, right? We all watching this video right now because we resonate with each other. We're a soul tribe. You guys join the Retang Gang community because you're looking for a soul tribe, people that resonate with you, right? That's what it's all about, man. Sometimes, the people that you think is closest to you, even family, might not be your soul tribe. That's your, your blood, your flesh and blood, but on a spiritual level, on a solar level, they don't understand you. They don't know you, they can't relate to you. Okay? So being alone helps you to find yourself. You're gonna find the answers to make the best decisions for your life. And that's what it's all about. It might be hard for some. I know some people, it's, it's hard for us to be alone because you got to face those inner demons, some traumas. You might have had abandonment issues, so you don't like feeling that. But understand that this is going to help you heal. OK, being around people and getting that validation from them is not going to help you out. It's going to make you worse. It's going to make you dependent. You need to be self-sufficient. OK, in 2024, you got to be self-sufficient. You don't know who you're meeting out here anymore. People aren't who they appear to be. Okay, the veil is lifted. There's a lot of people walking around here who aren't who they look like. Not what you see with the physical eyes, okay? People got spirits and entities attached to them. All right? So, I want to give you guys this message to give you some insight and to let you know that you're not alone, man. Right? As a collective, we're all in this together. We don't got to be right next to each other to understand each other and to resonate with each other. It's an energy, right? When we go into meditation mode, we connect with each other. This is why sometimes you guys get on here and say, man, I was just thinking about this and you made a video about it. Man, I was just thinking this. I was just going through this and you made a video about it. That's because the thought process, the energy, we all feeling the same thing. We're a soul tribe. You feel me? So y'all keep walking righteous, man. You know, don't let nobody deter you from your path. 
Because being around people can deter you from your path and you can forget who you are. You'll get distracted so much that you forgot what you were doing here in the first place. You know, like you playing a game, you get distracted with all these side quests and all these random events that you forget to do the main mission. You're not even going through the story mode. You know what I'm saying? The game is not progressing because all you're doing is playing around. It's time for us to get serious. It's time for us to complete our mission. You feel what I'm saying? So let's get it, man. Hey, if you guys need to speak with me, I do one-on-one -on -one consultations. Also tap into the Retain Gang community if you want to tap in with your soul tribe with a group of people that's like-minded. All right, so with that being said, peace, love, and abundance, and I'm out.